Hey everybody, it's Chris from the Droning Company here with Barry Maxwell of Command. And I gotta tell you, I'm six foot three, I'm about 240 pounds, and I can I very rarely come across drones that can fit me inside. This is one of the exceptions. This thing is a spectacle. So, you know, what I want to learn a little bit is a little bit more about Command, okay. a little bit more about what you do for Command, and a little bit more about this guy right here. Okay, great. Yeah, I'm Barry Maxwell, I'm Senior Director of Business Development for Command Precision Products, a segment. This is one part of our segment. It's our first real uh, autonomous drone that we're working on. Uh, Command has been in the industry for about 80 years. Um, used to work with Charlie Command, our founder, used to work for Sikorsky uh, and broke away in the early 40s and, uh, and started his own helicopter company. And he actually was on the forefront of doing unmanned uh, vertical lift. Uh, starting about 1957, he actually made the first unmanned helicopter. Wow, that's awesome. And, uh, and we've been you know, in the helicopter business since. We've had other un unmanned uh, systems. Uh, we had an unmanned K-Max helicopter, which is heavy lift, which served three years in Afghanistan with the US Marine Corps. And uh, this is sort of an offshoot of, of that uh, development. Uh, they discovered that they didn't need as much lift as the K-Max was able to provide. And so this is addressing more of their sweet spot that, uh, that they found that they needed. And so, again, it is, as you said, it's the largest uh, one around. It is designed to lift about 800 pounds and has range up to 520 or so nautical miles in the deployment range. Now, in terms of operating this within FAA regulations, I'm sure that doesn't happen a lot because it sounds like it's a military application, but you know, how, do you, how do you address that? It is, has a range of about 500 miles. How do you address that? Well, let me clarify one thing. It's not just a military application. It is, it is really dual use. There's a tremendous amount of interest in it in the commercial world, especially in oil and gas as for transportation to and from oil rigs, for instance. And we actually have a partnership with a company called PHI okay. who provides services uh, to the oil industry. And uh, they're actually going to be our first commercial customer. And uh, so it has, it has interest on both sides. And it's, again, purely for the, for the cargo world. Uh, FAA certification, as any unmanned uh, platform system will tell you, is is a challenge, and and we're working we're working that now, um, and we're expecting actually to get our clearance to get our get our flight testing going here any day now. Uh, we've been working that issue for a while with the FAA because it's very new to them too. Yeah, Something this size with that sort of range, autonomous, is a big deal to them. So, absolutely. and we want to, of course do it safely and, and properly. So we're working with them. For sure. And you know, one of the things, first of all, the size struck me. And I think that's the case for most people that walk yeah. through here is it's a head turner. But then my second thought was, how do they power this thing? I mean, this isn't battery run, I'm sure. If it is, it's got to take some big batteries. Yeah. No, it is gas turbine engine. Okay. Um, we're using a Rolls-Royce uh, R300 engine in it okay. uh, because we need that in order to be able to provide the lift and the duration. Um, EV tall is great, it's wonderful, and, is, and will eventually be the future. But as you said, battery technology is not quite there to get you the range and the power that you need to do what this is being designed to do. So when the technology gets there, then we can flex to doing that. Absolutely. So now, if somebody wants to learn a little, a little bit more about com Command and you know the products that you offer, you know whatever operation they might have, where do they go to learn a little bit more about your operation? Okay. So for the cargo specifically, uh, if you go to command-cargo.com, that's cargo is K-A-R-G-O dot com, uh, we'll take you directly to this product page. Uh, but if you go to command K-A-M-A-N dot com. It covers our, our entire company with our all 14 of our divisions. Excellent. Now, one last question. How long before you can take me for a ride in this thing? <laughs> well, we'll just fold you up in the bottom, no problem. <laughs> Excellent. Well, hey, Barry, thank you so much for your time. Really appreciate it. Great meeting you, too. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you.